Hello YouTubers, today I'm going to show you how to access your files on your iPod or iPhone. So let's get started. First you're going to need to install OpenSSH in Cydia and if you don't have Cydia please watch my other video to show you how to get that. So let's go ahead and go to Cydia. Okay, go to search and type in open SSH. Okay, as you can see, I have open SSH already installed. Once you install this, you no longer have to worry about this. Now, you're going to have to install a program called WinSCP and this is how you access your root folders on your iPod or iPhone. So let's go ahead and set it up. Go ahead and click new. Host name is going to be the IP address of your iPod or iPhone and to check that all you have to do is okay. If you already have SBS settings go ahead and swipe your status bar at the top and then your IP address is going to be right there. If you don't, just go to settings, go to Wi Fi, click on the little arrow, and right there is going to be your IP address. Okay, so type in your IP address right here for username you're going to type root R O O T and for password by default it's going to be Alpine A L P I N E and you can always change your password to whatever you want later on but for now go ahead and save this and click login it's going to ask for my password since I changed my password I'm going to go ahead and enter it Okay, there we go. I'm logged in. Now, what we're going to do is, uh, depending on what you want to do, I mean, you can do different things, but what I was, uh, I set up my theme for um, my iPod. I had to go into my var folder and I had to go to stash. And in here where it says themes, access this, and there's going to be a bunch of folders uh, saying shortcut 0, shortcut 1, shortcut 2. Had to cut all of those out and, and uh, paste them into applications folder. See here, you can see them all. And this was so I can set up my themes for the spring jumps. All these shortcuts are your spring jumps. So I had to set that all up to make that work properly. Anyway, um, that was just showing you how to um, use WinSCP and OpenSSH to access your, your root folder. So I um, hope you enjoyed this video. Comment and rate and many more videos to come. Have a great day.